reacting to a bottle snatching trend at the European Championship started by Cristiano Ronaldo, UEFA has asked players on the 24 teams to stop removing strategically placed sponsored drinks from the news conference platforms. Ronaldo, Paul Pogba and Manuel Locatelli removed sponsored bottles away from the view of cameras when taking their seats at media briefings this week. Euro 2020 tournament director Martin Callan said, UEFA has communicated with the teams regarding this matter. It is important because the revenues of the sponsors are important for the tournament and for European football, Callan said in a briefing. Coca-Cola and Henkein are among 12 top-tier sponsors for Euro 2020 who contributed to UEFA's total tournament revenue of almost 2 billion euros. The values of individual sponsor deals are not published, but UEFA got 483 million euros in sponsorship deals from 10 partners at Euro 2016 in France. Players also indirectly get money from Euro 2020 commercial income via their national federations and clubs. The 24 national federations competing at Euro 2020 will share 371 million euros in UEFA prize money, which typically helps pay player bonuses. The championships can get a maximum of 34 million euros from UEFA by also winning all three of their group games. Hundreds of clubs worldwide also get shares from at least 200 million euros allocated by UEFA from Euro 2020 revenue as a reward for releasing their players to European national teams. Of that money, 130 million euros is allocated on a daily route for about 630 players taking part in the final tournament. Euro 2020 revenue will also fund 775 million euros as UEFA has promised to its 55 member federations in annual grants and development project funds for the period of 2020 to 2024. Subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Click the bell button and enjoy the latest uploads from our channel.